Welcome back to my channel. If you are joining us for the first time, thank you so much for joining us. If you are coming back, welcome back. We are so, so happy to see you. Today I have, as you can see, two guest hosts. This is my Olivia. Hello. And this is my River. Hello. Now River is the pyrographer in the family. He loves to burn wood. So this idea for Mother's Day is actually his idea. We are going to be burning some wood um, for Mother's Day. Some little personalized gifts, DIY, that you can do at home for mom. And we are going to use some resin to glaze them and then tie it off with a pretty little bow. Um, it's going to be a beautiful little gift that you can give to mom. Probably not something that the little ones can do. It's more of an adolescent kind of teenage idea that you can do um, because these little wood burners are extremely hot. They are going to burn into the wood, which we are going to get into here in a minute. And these wood burners, really bad, you yeah, burn if you were to burn yourself, it blisters, it burns. It's not something that you want to do unsupervised. Um, parents, please take care and watch your kids. Um, when you're doing this, now the little ones can get into the resin, or if they wanted to add some glitter to the resin and help paint and glaze over the wood, that may be something that they can do. Um, to personalize it, we can actually um, burn a number one mom, if you want to show them the ones that we have, or love you mom, something like that. That may be something that they can do, but definitely not using these tools because they are extremely hot. Now these tools you can purchase for $30 at Michael's. That's where we got ours from. Okay, Liv, put them down. Wait. They can see. Wait, it's weird because no, it, it puts yeah, the ones over here. It's fine. It changes where the stuff is. <laughs> you can purchase these at Michael's for about $30 to $32, depending on where you get them from. I always use a coupon. You know that I'm a big fan of Michael's, so I'm on their VIP list. So uh, the coupons I use are about 50% 50 off. The kit comes with these amazing little um, tools. They're little stamps, I guess you could say. Do you want to show them that? Uh -huh. So they can see the little um, stamps. That's how we made the patterns. Yeah, it comes with it four different tips, it comes with an exacto knife, and it comes with Olivia, let him finish. Different, I don't know how to say it. It's like, I don't know where to order it. What is it? It's like a stamp. Yeah. It's like a stamp that will burn a pattern into the wood, and we're going to show you how to do that today. Oh! See? That's going to melt into my floor. No, it won't. It has a guard here for a reason. Okay. So, yes. So, um, come on. Come sit down, Liv. Oh, I was going to say something. Okay, we'll show it to him. Um, so there's these. There's a sigil, a heart, a uh, flower, a sphere, a wet tin... Not a wet tin, though. A, um... A, a diamond? Yeah. A diamond that is a triangle, a star, and just a humongous sigil. Yeah. And then there's a swirl <clears> right <throat> there. Now today I'm going to be using the swirl. Then you have the ejecto knife right here. And then the tips right here. Now there are some tips that are just like a point, so it's almost like a pin. And that's how we got to get the number one mom. That's how I used that. And the one that says, I love you mom. That's how I got that. I just used the pin. To oh, it's been actually, Yeah, I know. It's okay. That's how I got to do the I love you, Mom, with the pinpoint. So, that's okay. Not a big deal. So, let's get started. Now, what I'm doing is just going to be a border so you can see um, how quickly this burns into these um, unfinished wood pieces. It's not gonna take you very long, um, but please, please, please be careful because as you can see, they burn quite deep and they are quite hot. Usually it takes about 10 minutes to, for them to heat up, but if you leave them on one day, the hotter it dips. Yeah, and I can feel the heat in the actual grip. But this little spiral uh, pattern is really, really cute. It's very intricate. And of course, the longer you leave it on, the deeper and darker the burn is going to be. Because remember, it's burning the wood. Well, 
when we were doing our larger Flint. burning pro projects, we try to do it outside just because it is burning and the wood may the wood burning like the uh, smoke may set off your alarm. So please keep that in mind when you're working on with this kind of stuff. Now, if you'll show them what this looks like up close, please. Be careful. So this is what it looks like. Um, as you can see, we did a new stamp than these. Show them the back of the spin so they can see the hearts. That's what the hearts will look like. And then here's what the flowers will look like. As you can see, this one says number one mom, and that one says love the mom. Okay, now bring that back. Now I'm just doing this one real quick. I'm sorry. To show you kind of real quickly how to do this. Now, in order to change this, this thing is extremely hot. So I'm not going to, of course, change it with my fingers. You use this Olivia. and you grab it and you twist it. I'm going to use a pair of pliers. Um, you can just turn it off and wait for it to, to cool and then turn it back on. Um, but in the name of time, I rarely do that because I don't like to be waiting all that time. You're impatient. I'm very impatient. My son knows. And how do you do so much resin? Each Because you one. can do it and then you just do something else while you're waiting. Yeah, because I have yeah, everything in stages. It takes a day. Yeah. yeah so I have other pieces These waiting. These take like weeks if you do them correctly. Or, not if you do them correctly, but like, if you make them really detailed, it's going to take a while. Yeah. But intricacy is something that I enjoy as well. Making sure that things are done correctly. And if things are done in stages... It makes me happy. Because while some things are waiting to cure, other things are being what needed to paint. You're always busy. Yeah, there's always something to do. While some things are waiting to be painted, other things are waiting to be having hardware attached. So there's always something that needs to be done. Is this hot? Don't mess with it, Olivia. If you touch it, you'll find out if it's hot. Don't touch it. You see how it melted into the plastic? Mm -hmm. It's very, very hot. Please don't touch it. I don't know why I was about to say don't try this at home, but we're making this so you can do it at home. Sorry. If this is a DIY that you can do it at home, fine. Okay, so I'm going to wait for this to get hot because I'm going to uh, write in here number one mom, and then we're going to go ahead and glaze it just on this one. <laughs> oh, River, you spit on me. Disgusting. That's gross. I am truly trying so hard not to be laughing. Hmm. I think wouldn't you You know what no, else is disgusting? Oh. What? Turning and driving. Don't <laughs> correctly. <laughs> How would you see if it if it hurt? Does it hurt? I just wanted to know. No, no, I just wanted to know. <laughs> no! Missy. Ah! Missy, I'll show you. No, Missy. <laughs> I'm not even going to hit you that hard. I'm going to hit you exactly how hard you hit me. But I try. Ah! I barely even put it in okay. place. Okay, it hurts. It's not very nice. Just saying. You did it first! What is it? Pinterest? Etsy. Etsy. Yeah. 
All righty. Kitten poke. So now if you want to go show them this. Number one mom. As you number can see, my, my number one mom just made a number one mom for my drama. Boom. Boom. Number. And as you can see, there are many different ways to do it. As you see, mm. she put, she, I almost burned my. Throat. As you see, they look. <laughs> I went like these, that right there. These two look. Stupid. These two look exactly different. Much different because exactly. They were. Come on, keep going. And because there are many ways to do it, and this one she just did dot until she got the four word, and this one she just drew. So yeah. So I'll put that right there. Now this one. Now I'm gonna turn this off and let it cool because I'm not gonna use this anymore. So now we're gonna mix our uh, one to one epoxy resin. Now this part. The little ones can do because it's not really that big a deal. But they should be wearing gloves or at least need to be careful because it, Put is, your gloves on. it is a chemical. Mm -hmm. It's a two part chemical. Also, make sure that the measurements are about the same. One to one. Each part. One to one. Because if not, then it won't. Solidify it's a correctly. one to one ratio. And then you would have went with your family. Yes, you would have. She's putting on her gloves. <laughs> I'm peeing about a chocolate tank with delight. Okay, now mix it. No. Where is the brush that I can back with my money? The faster you mix it, you the more air, bu air bubbles will be inside of it. Mm -hmm. But... You can just use a lighter to get that out. Get yeah. You, you can use a lighter to get the air bubbles out. Like if you hover the fire right over the resin when you're done. Or you can get a heat gun. Yeah, heat guns, I just dryers. recently got a heat gun. Blow dryers too? No. A blow dryer will blow the resin everywhere. Not actually. No. Y yeah. No, I'm right. No, you're wrong. I'm right. I'm proud of myself because one of them isn't my friend that I told him to follow me. So, one of them? Uh, yeah, I'm getting out there. There you go. Yeah. There you go. I just made a new one because me and my boys were messing around in Conan. Mm -hmm. And, like, since I'm the only girl, I had Sean Hurry go up. out into the the water. And you, do you know the Moto Moto meme? Okay, well, it, the Moto Moto meme is like this really big, like, buff hippo. Mm hmm. And like these three female hippos. Mm -hmm. And they're like, look out, I think Moto Moto likes you. Here he comes. And then Moto Moto just like comes out of the water. Who's Moto Moto? That big brolic, like. Hippo? Yeah. Okay. And then he says, funny. I like them late and I like them. I'll, I'll show you the video. You're gonna have to show me. <laughs> He's weird. I guess I'm out of touch. It was, old. it was hilarious <laughs> because remember, I was just laying on my bed. Listen, I was just laying there. on my bed no, listening to my remember, remember, It was hilarious because I was just laying on my bed listening to my music when I heard you yell, I cannot believe Sandra said, I like them big. I like them. <laughs> <laughs> and then I heard you okay. and then I heard you yell. Hashtag Moto Moto. Hashtag Moto Moto. Hashtag For You Page. Are you gonna put uh, a number one mom on there? Or? Yes, I'm not done. Olivia, okay. will you go over there and give me my phone? Watch out! Whatever, bro. Mr. Moto Moto. Oh, yeah, I like a chunky. Oh, yeah. Big E. Oh, yeah. Chunky monkey. I like catching chunky monkey. <laughs> Chunky. 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 I like it's touching phones. You're <laughs> Olivia, settle down. Yeah, I like my background. Yeah. Here you show it to me. I like well, I'm sorry, bro. Watch I'll out, show you Olivia. Again. It feels weird when you settle touch down. stuff. In this. Settle down. It's weird. I thought you turned it off. I don't care. I it. did, but that means it still has to and cool off. It doesn't just shut off like a light. Look I love the push phones there. Let's so this me. is... Cookie, a cookie sheet, just parchment paper. 
my my intercessor and my anthem. Okay, well, you come chill. Hey, well, yeah, stop. I thought that was a deal. Anyway. Whoa, chill pal, Brian. Well, but when did you get a um, tit on the top? A long time ago. I just really told you. You do not need a tit on the top. I know. Because I'm, I'm mature, bro. <laughs> All right. Yeah. So, mature. So, uh. I'm more mature than you are, and I know how to not talk to child predators. Yeah. All righty, Lou. You know so now I'm going to put this on top of the parchment paper. Mrs. Social Butterfly. Hey. What? It's not, it's not a. So we're gonna lay this on top of the parchment paper, mm -hmm. and that's when um, Bite me, we're gonna go ahead and start to glaze it. We're just gonna use a regular paintbrush, dip it into our mixture, what are you doing? and just start to paint it. I am a god right now. Now you can always pour a little bit on there. What are you doing? Chill out, Olivia. I'm just showing them different ways to do it, and then you're gonna take over. There you go. We use the parchment paper so that if any of it spills over, and once it dries, you can just lift it right off. I think my idea. Now you can use different colors, different color inks, different color um, glitters. Um, you could probably even use different color sharpies on the wood before you glaze it to seal it, and it would probably come out really pretty. Make sure to put it on thick. Yeah. Or you may now, want to course, do like two or three coats. Yeah. Epoxy resin dries in about eight to 12 hours. So these are going to take a while to make. So make sure it's not like a last minute Mother's Day gift because um, it won't be ready in time. You're not going all the way down. Look, you're missing all these little spots. You can take it from the middle and bring it out. Okay, now once you're done glazing and everything is done, then you have something that looks like this. And these are already glazed. Now I probably could have done one or two more um, coats of the glaze, which I may end up doing after we're done with this video, but I did want to get this to show you guys. And what we're gonna do is get mom's favorite color ribbon. Give me the scissors. And we're gonna take a kind of a long piece because we're gonna wrap it around both of them. Now you can make a whole bouquet of, you know, six or 12 pieces, depending on, you know, how much you wanna go in for mom, how much she's in the uh, kitchen, works. yeah, how much she works. Or if you wanted to just um, have it as a decoration for the kitchen for her. And we're just gonna tie a pretty little bow on it. Good. You know how much moms love things that are made for her by her kiddos. Now this ribbon has a lot of glitter on it, so I'm getting glitter everywhere. So if you want to pick one that doesn't have any glitter, that's fine. Yeah, if mom's not a glitter girl, now glitter for me is my favorite color, so glitter on everything. So then we have a pretty little um, gift for mom that's homemade by you, the people that she loves the most, her family, her kids, and then that along with a lovely breakfast in bed and a beautiful card, and you have yourself a wonderful Mother's Day gift. Come sit down so you can say bye. That is all for today, so thank you so, so much for joining us. Um, please uh, like and subscribe if you can. Check out the um, links at the bottom because I will show you where to get all of this fun stuff for yourself. Also, check out the Instagram page, Facebook, and all that other good stuff. I also have an Etsy shop so that you can shop for some of my other goodies. Um, I guess I will see you guys on the next video.